This week's geek update, I've uh, strapped an old Android phone to the rear view mirror. Um, obviously powered down, can't really be seen from the outside because the mirror is covering most of it. Uh, you can still see out the rear view mirror as well. Uh, but the trick to get things happen is when you turn the ignition on, or the engine, what happens then is the phone automatically boots up. And being as it's Android, uh, once it hits the OS, you can get it to do pretty much whatever you want. Um, I've had it to go straight into uh, a sat nav, so as soon as I drive off anywhere, I've got a sat nav map blaring away within eyes vision really not obstructing my vision from the outside either let's wait for it to boot up just set a wallpaper there of whatever you want hello Torotity Sports Systems integration started GPS navigation active there you have it, uh, an automated, the app which runs the app as soon as it boots up. Uh, you can get it to uh, talk to you like that. So, so there you have it, GPS navigation. Uh, but the magic bit happens again. So when you've got to your destination and you've got to wherever you're going, you turn the engine off, take the key out. Then, if you notice, it said something, and it said uh, power disconnected, shut down requested. I've set it to give you a few seconds before it does shut down, uh, just in case you uh, stop and then decide to drive off again. Your phone won't turn off, and then you have to wait. So there you have it. The phone is automatically turned off as soon as you uh, pull the key out. And there you have it. You could have it to. Uh, tether on Skype as well. You can tether it to your phone in your pocket. So there's obviously no SIM in this. Phone's only worth a tenner really. It's a Moto G. Battered old Moto G at that. Um, there you have it. 